best is you. Hopefully you are in good health and safety during this pandemic. And we are always hoping this pandemic will end soon and we could resume our activities as before. Now I would like to discuss about how to compose a cash flow for Beijing plan operation for ready mix complete supply for construction in the oil and gas field. So this program consists of 10 workshops. This is start from design with proportion and material unit price table, material cost, calculation, okay. Minimum best plan and power and straight in and, and is rich. Monthly main power cost breakdown, material procurement schedule, material allocation schedule, major construction equipment insurance cost, Beijing plan operational cost, and here it is the estimated case flow. So, before we, we are discussing this program, I would like to inform you the term and condition applied for this program is for this program are okay so first concrete volume for this project is cover 12,628 cubic meter by composition Concrete type 1, 6,883. Concrete type 5, 5,745. And for, this, for the scheduled periods or contract periods, 13 months. So we have, we have also monthly, monthly concrete demand schedule. Okay, as you see on the screen here. Okay, and sorry, and the major construction equipment should be owned by the company. So we only calculate. So we only calculate the insurance costs for the major construction equipment. Also, we have competitive unit price that over by supplier support this project okay now we start from the concrete make design before we start this project we should have concrete make design the compost for these projects and Concrete mix design composition approved by main client, uh, sorry, main contractor and client. So, after we got approval, we found we found summary concrete mix design as seen on the screen here. Okay, this is for the all class of the concrete, starting from class G. By the strength, two thousand by type 1, class D, by the strength 2000, by type 5, class A, with the strength 4000, by type 1, class A1, by strength 5000, and the type 1, and the last one is class A2, by strength 5000, and by type 5, five sorry. And then, we could see here, the material proportion for a class of the concrete yes uh, for example for class g strength 2000 by type 1 okay we we have material proportion for men 270 kilogram and for water for water 1000 why well, sorry 175 kilogram uh, sand, sand local by the by the quantity 
of 520 kilogram aggregate to 162 the tire one liter and what is the main ratio 0 0.6 84 and then slum what of initial and speed spike okay and this is same also for other class of the concrete yes we we have material proportion for each class okay okay and then we we have some competitive price offering by our supplier support for this project is by the condition receive on site yes receive on site this is on site basis cost yes okay we found here the need price for the aggregate as seen on the screen here yes and this is and for others concrete raw material aggregate and then sand cement sorry cement uh, concrete sand okay okay and then and then we make a calculation table for the material cost yes it's seen on the screen here for the e class of concrete yes we have total supply here for the class of the concrete for example concrete class d type 1 by strength 2000 psi we have total supply 1613 and we have material proportion we have material proportion based on the sign mix based on approved design mix and then uh, we calculate design mean design mix a design mix and the total of concrete supply yes the total of concrete supply of a class and then we found the quantity uh, for the cement here and then for the aggregate here and the pore sand here and also for the daratan and daracham so, so super plastic retarder and super plastic sizer i mean and then we have unit price unit price here yes this is based on unit price that propose that over by our contractor support this project okay and we all we we also include loss factor loss factor for the each concrete pro material and then we we found total price for each concrete concrete pro material and then finally we found the total price for each class of concrete here and we found also within price per cubic meter class of each concrete okay here unit price for cubic meter concrete is found from a divide from dividing by dividing total total price with the total supply of each class is it okay and this is the other the other material uh, material unit uh, material price for other class of concrete this is for d uh, d type 5 base strength 3000 psi and as uh, the price is here and this is the unit price uh, also for concrete class a type 1 for for strength 4000 psi okay this is the total price and this is the unit price and the last one is total price for the concrete class a2 with a strength with a strength 5000 and with a type 5 okay the total price we found here and this is the unit price per cubic meter and then we found the grand total of the total price here 
Okay, now, now we jump to other section or other worksheet. So, as seen on the screen here, we compose monthly manpower, uh, sorry, uh, minimum base plan manpower and its way. Yes. So, we only assign uh, the personnel for Jakarta hire or key personnel and local hire uh, for direct manpower only. Yes. And this is the breakdown of the total manpower, both of direct and indirect or key personnel only, for supporting this project. And then we found uh, the total unit weight for its manpower or its personnel. Here. Also, we calculate the cost for mobilization and then mobilization for its personnel also leave allowance for three months okay and then uh based on the batman uh, the bat batman manpower rates we calculate monthly manpower cost breakdown yes this is this is based on uh basic salary that we compose in uh in prep previously seats here yes okay and then we calculate mob demo cost leave for three months uh, resident allowance project allowance service allowance uh, meal allowance natural nat natural 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 allowance and natural allowance sorry transport allowance functional allowance ship allowance uh, this is the total basic salary. Yes, this is uh, estimate total overtime, and this is the overall cost for each personnel. And based on this monthly manpower cost breakdown, okay, we make or we compose monthly manpower allocation schedule. Yes, this is. Uh, this is adjusted to the monthly concrete demand schedule but we compose the manpower allocation schedule uh, two months two month earlier uh, from the monthly concrete demand schedule this is for uh, for a specific reason or a specific interest uh, to the project okay and we demobilize uh, certain personnel uh, two months ahead. Eh? This is for uh, to uh, to complete all outstanding matters. Yes, regarding to the project outstanding. Okay. Okay. And now here. Monthly manpower allocation schedule. Okay. Monthly manpower allocation allocation schedule. And it costs. It monthly costs. So we found the grand total cost for the monthly for the manpower allocation here. Yes. Yes, this one. This one. This is including all allowance apply to each personnel yes this is the total manpower allocation cost and then we device material procurement schedule it cost and quantities yes this is the material procurement composed one month ahead or one month earlier uh, from the monthly concrete demand schedule, yes. Okay, here. This is the monthly concrete demand schedule, yes. Then, then this is a, a PO or subcontracting. This is a material procurement, yes. A material procurement. Uh, 
device or uh, sorry compose for one month ahead or for one month earlier yes this is the concrete raw material quantities here and this is the material cost yes this is the material cost and this is we found uh, the total material cost yeah, the total material cost okay and this is the material allocation schedule yes this is material allocation schedule this is material local allocation schedule uh, this this section is is composed um, based on the based on the material material schedule yes material schedules adjusted to the monthly concrete demand schedule okay here and we procure this material one month one month ahead or one month earlier yeah from the monthly concrete demand schedule okay and then insulin cost as i mentioned uh, as i mentioned before uh, the major construction the major construction equipment should be owned by the company so in this program we also calculate the insurance costs for the major construction equipment okay here it is yes here it is and the total uh, for the premium uh, insurance for 1.4 year yes 1.4 Four year. This means sixteen month. Yes, yeah, sixteen months. Okay. And then we found the total price. Yes, for the premium. Yeah, for the premium major construction equipment insurance. Yes, this is operational cost. Yes, operational cost. Yes, uh, we compose the detail operational costs for Beijing plan operation for the Beijing plan operation yeah starting from temporary facility so kind of construction for the temporary facility we should calculate here yes calculate is yes, starting from site office yes uh, contain of office container 40 feet yes and the laboratory office container 40 feet staff office container 40 feet uh, quantity to unit for the office container and mechanics laboratory of office uh, laboratory office at our container 40 feet one unit staff office container 40 feet one unit mechanic tool container 40 feet one unit and this is the price estimation yeah price estimation cement storage construction for cement storage uh, and, and this is uh, the estimated price yeah, of estimated price for this construction cement storage and then workshop construction for the workshop shelter construction for water for concrete construction for power house with the uh, with the size with the size yes with the size detail and then uh, and then uh, cam and housing temporary fence gates ditch etc okay and then we calculate office and mesh supply yes direct office supply and then uh, uh, indirect office supply yes indirect office supply and then mesh supply and then uh, construction equipment maintenance and repair and repair sorry okay and then construction equipment and other supporting facilities mobilization and demobilization and home office cost home office cost for office supply and indirect cost and then other side operational cost okay and here it is the total for the operational cost yes yeah okay and then we we put uh all calculation cost yes all, all calculation cost that we made 
that we calculate already in the previously worksheets and we put in the we put in this cash flow yeah in this cash flow template yes in this uh, cash flow template based on its own allocation yes okay so we should we should be carefully to uh, to compose the price uh, based on its allocation yeah based on its allocation so this is the concrete supply yeah this is the concrete supply yeah this is uh, monthly concrete demand schedule yeah starting uh, starting on the peak month yeah peak month of this uh, of this cash flow yeah of this cash flow sorry of this cash flow yeah okay so for the uh, for the cash in cash in budget yes cash in budget here we receive the down payment we receive the down payment uh sorry one two three yeah uh four month earlier yeah four month earlier uh before the first before the for before the uh starting month of the congress supply yeah and then we receive the payment for mobilization and the mobilization here yes 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 sorry okay uh payment for mobilization and the mobilization here uh, this is the uh, three months yeah three months earlier yeah before the first month concrete supply yes and then cash out budget yes cash out budgets we uh we put the mobilization and demobilization cost in the in the sorry in the one two three four months yeah four months uh before the first month congress apply and then recondition recondition for uh for baking plan equipment and other tool this is uh, uh we we arrange five months earlier yeah before the first month congress apply okay and then this is only this is uh this is best plan installation and supervision yeah this is uh best plan installation and supervision uh we arrange we arrange we arrange this cost yes we arrange or allocate this cost uh three months three months earlier for the best plan foundation construction sorry for the uh, for the construction of best plan foundation and two months earlier uh before the first month concrete supply for the supervision yes for the supervision and this is the certification certification yes we put two months before the first month concrete supply and this is purchase material yeah purchase material we put uh one month one month ahead or one month earlier before the first the first month concrete supply here okay and then for the office for the temporary facility for the uh, sorry for the construction equipment for construction equipment we uh we put or we allocate this cost uh four months four months yeah four months earlier before the first month concrete supply uh also for the manpower manpower insurance yeah four months earlier before concrete supply okay and then uh, this is for temporary uh, operational cost yeah firstly for temporary facility this is uh, we allocate three months before the first month concrete supply okay and the mesh supply the mesh supply this is uh, we allocate uh, all together with the first month of concrete supply okay and as said above uh, in this cash flow we 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 use the project capital yes project capital or own capital yeah or company capital invested for this project yes uh this this project capitals is the company capital utilized for supporting this project uh, this this cost allocates uh for the 
Foresight Board, uh, Foresight Board uh, project operational cost that minus that minus in the earlier of the project schedule, yeah, in the earlier project schedule. That's why we use uh, company capital or project capital, yeah. And this is uh, process material, okay, as I said. As I said previously, this is uh, so, sorry, should allocated uh, one month, one month before uh, before the first month complete supply, okay, okay, and this is the construction equipment as well. Yes, construction equipment as well. We allocate uh, four months before the first month of complete supply, and then uh, this is the temporary facility. Yeah, we should allocate uh, three months earlier. Yeah. Three months earlier. This is uh, this is any capital return, yeah. Any capital return, uh, capital return. This is uh, cost of money, yeah. We we calculate uh, project project capital or company capital. We calculate and return back as a cost of money, yeah. Cost of money. And we make schedule for the for the for the for the pay. Uh, cost of money from uh, from own, own capital or company capital yes we make a schedule and we make schedule uh, for the cost allocation for the refund of cost of money okay for the refund uh, sorry for the for payment cost of money yes this is based on the excess balance Excess balance of its of its uh, of its excess balance of its monthly excess yeah uh, of a monthly excess we found in uh, in each allocation yeah in each allocation cost okay and this is the spaces for the for the calculation of the uh, cost of money yeah of money this is and i already make a formula therein therein to make is uh, for the calculation of the cost of money okay and this accumulative balance for this project is uh here it is 249 to so 249 thousand uh Six hundred thirty-six point eighty-eight dollars. Yes. Okay. Okay. Then this all information needed to compose the good estimated cash flow. But the main important, but then the main important key to compose the good estimated cash flow in this case is project schedule. Yes. The project schedule uh, should become a reference or basic information to compose the good estimated cash flow. Yes, to well allocated it project cost. Okay, I make this video to visually explain the posting that I posted on LinkedIn on Lincoln. Yes, and hopefully you are understand well. You are clearly understand how to compose the estimated cash flow for Beijing plan operation for a mixed concrete supply in the construction oil and gas field but should you have any question related to the cash flow you can reach me at imranamami at gmail.com okay thank you very much for your attention hopefully this uh, this program or this video is useful for you and see you in next video assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh